Okay, so I'm going to show you how to retouch a photo in um, Aperture. just want to show you the metadata really quick so you can see. I've got an old Digital Rebel XTI, so don't have any type of very fancy camera. You can see that my ISO was set at 200. I had the lens at uh, focal length set at 17 millimeters uh, with an f-stop of 11 and using um, a very, very slow shutter speed on a tripod. So this photo uh, is great for online, um, probably not sure if I could have done much better because I have all that backlight coming in off this back wall here. But in uh, Apple's Aperture, this is a very easy fix. And the first thing we're going to do is try and straighten up this photo a little bit down here with a straighten tool. Make it so it looks about the way we want. And I'll probably go off of these lines, uh, this mullion on the window and the center line on the glass door uh, is my level or straight point. Um, <clears throat> and then what I want to do is I want to remove all this shadow here and I want to remove the shadow here but if I just use the shadow correction tools or the lighten or contrast modes of most photo editing software the back end is going to really start to wash out. So what we do is go into adjustments and we're going to go down to the Highlights and Shadows tab here. We're going to uh, click on this little gear and we're going to um, brush Highlights and Shadows away. It's going to open a little dialog box over here. We'll put it in the middle. And what we want to do is a number of things here. We're going to leave it on the eraser tool. I've already got my brush size set about where I want. My softness is going to be very large. Um, and my strength is going to be large. So I'm going to leave that alone. I'm going to go in here and I've got a number of options. Okay, my brush range is going to be all and I'm going to put a color overlay. And what we don't want is we don't want to wash out the back. So I'm going to, I'm going to erase out the area where I don't want the uh, uh, area to get brightened as I wash out these shadows. So we're going to erase this section. I got a little bit of white up in the corner here. We'll blend it. You can see in my circle, the center circle is where it's the strongest and then that gap between the inner circle and the outer circle, that's how it feathers out. That's the softness and if I change uh, down here on the softness, you can see how that changes uh, the circle right there in front of you. So now I'm going to turn off my overlay and when I come back over here to my shadows uh, scrolling tab you'll see that now I can uh, brighten up these outside edges of the picture and it does not affect the background portion of this photo and it blends pretty well. Um, this is not going to go probably into a print piece uh, large enough where people will be able to detect um, how I've kind of washed that out a little bit. But that is, uh, in Aperture, uh, a very quick way to adjust a photo. And you saw in this tutorial how fast this was to do and uh, get it ready for some online marketing.